Hi, I'm Keith Melton, the president of Cane Masters. We are the sole remaining custom cane company in the United States. And we have the great pleasure of working with people daily to help them know how to walk with and use a cane. Now, if you have received medical advice or you're working with a trained therapist, you should always follow what they tell you in the way to carry a cane. However, in our many years of experience and thousands and thousands of customers, we've observed that most people carry a cane incorrectly. And what you see most people carry is a cane with a horn to the rear. And this is the common thing that you see. I'm an engineer by training. In my experience and in our work here in the world of canes, we find that that is ergonomically incorrect that you are far more efficient to use a cane with the horn forward. So the short stubby part should be forward. Now this seems counterintuitive, but as an engineer, it makes sense. When you stand with a cane, what you're trying to do is get the most support. A cane is not a substitute for a crutch, but it is intended to give you balance and stability, and it can also be useful for personal protection. When you have a cane in a traditional way that you see most people, your weight is here and you'd like to try to get the axis of your arm parallel to the shaft, but you're always cantilevered and forcing down on this round part. It is not as comfortable. In our experience, turning the cane 180 degrees so the horns forward gives you the ability now to directly align your forearm with the shaft and it's far more comfortable. There is more surface area for your hand. And if you opt for one of our internal palm rests, the heel of your palm fits nicely at the base of the palm rest. And so it's very comfortable to carry, whether you're standing and need to shift some of your weight, or walking to the mailbox, or walking the dogs. The second reason is that if you ever see someone walking with a cane with a horn forward, probably a pretty good idea that they've had some training because they realize the fact that you can quickly bring your cane in position, you can maneuver it, you can have access to it, you can simply, because the horn is reversed, you can go immediately into a helicopter spin and it's there. This is one of the hallmarks of using a cane. Anyone with training will automatically be carrying it horn forward. But even if you're just walking the dogs, enjoying a walk in the mall with your wife, it's a practical way. It's certainly one that we recommend. If you have any questions about carrying a cane or would like a free cane consultation, please reach out to us online or just give us a call.